My name is India Meaning and I work for Impressions Gallery and I work as our learning and audience development coordinator. It's internationally recognised as a sort of an excellent venue for contemporary photography. We're always free, so to have that cultural offer right on, the, on your doorstep if you live in Bradford, it's fantastic. The kind of exhibitions that we try and show are things that we feel um, uh, take creative risk, so things that could be seen as sometimes being controversial or difficult to understand, but we feel are really important. Um, our little kind of mission is to um, show photographs that get people looking, thinking and talking, and it is to sort of inspire debate and in sort of inspire people's ideas. We try and programme about five or six different exhibitions a year. Some of those are group shows and some of those are single shows. So the fact that Bradford's now been um, is a UNESCO city of film. Um, I think Bradford's got a really fantastic lens-based media offer and I think that actually starts to attract people to the city. We get a lot of people that come to the city to visit our exhibitions, um, that go to the Media Museum, you know, that, that actually draws people into the city centre, so that's really good. My name is uh, Tracy Wren. My role is um, Education Officer and that involves basically um, helping people engage with different works of art. We have um, quite an eclectic mix of exhibitions um, we have, it's a temporary exhibitions programme, so they change quite frequently. Unlike Impressions Gallery, uh, Bradford One Gallery has uh, lots of different media, so we have everything from um, cutting-edge design, contemporary art, um, photography, uh, both contemporary and um, from our archive collection. Um, but having a city centre base means that you bring in our collections and art right into the city centre, into the heart of the city. We're bringing it out to a wider audience. We're here with impressions, we've got the photographic gallery and it's really good to have a strong presence and a really good package for visitors outside of Bradford and also for the Bradford people to come to. The gallery is actually upstairs, so if you come through the foyer area and up the stairs... We do really want people to just come in off the street and drop in and see what we've got to offer in the gallery. At the entrance, you have um, the gallery's bookshop, which is actually one of um, the best specialist photographic bookshops, probably, you know, definitely in the region, possibly even in the north of England. There's two galleries that exist in this space. There's Impressions Gallery, which is a contemporary photography gallery, and there's also Bradford One Gallery, which is part of Bradford Museums and Galleries, and is Bradford's contemporary art gallery. Um, so you've got Impressions Gallery on that side, and Bradford One Gallery on that side.